And welcome back, guys, to another episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. My name is Rolo. In the last episode, we <laughs> cheated. We learned about the trick about, uh, you know, you jump from a high place, and and then you go like, hold on, and then you go like, uh, and then you go, and then you go like, and then you go like that, and then bam, you get all those, and then, you know, you get more. Yeah, we learned that trick. <laughs> So, expect me to be abusing that in between recording sessions, probably. So, we have to end this recording session on a good one. Let's do this shrine. And hopefully, this shrine does not be stuck for 30 plus minutes. It's always a gamble. But, to be fair, I've only had one shrine mess me up that bad. Fuck the rail shrine. Still saying that. Drifting flame. That sounds fine. What do I need to... Okay. Got my arrow back, too. That wasn't bad. What's this do? I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't understand. Game, help. Help me understand what you're trying to tell me here. Go like this, what happens? I, what? Do I need to get an object? I'm so confused. Can I use this? That's not heavy enough. I don't understand. Game. You're really making me mad. I need something that's heavy enough to to grab that. That one I can't. Is there really is that really the whole puzzle? Hold on. There's no way. There's no way that's the whole thing. There's got to be something I'm missing here. Which I wouldn't doubt. No, it really looks like that's the whole thing. can't recall it. Okay, you can't recall that. Unless, like... isn't heavy enough to keep that down. Wait a minute. I see something. There's something down there. You son of a bitch. How do I get down there? 
there an opening? YOLO. Okay. That's a plus. Go up. It's not going to work. What the hell? What the hell do I do? I'm so confused. And there's no ability that g gives me... I can't even think of a way. The only thing I can move is the... Do I need like special things? I've got things. I don't think they're heavy enough to keep that thing down though. Like, I don't fucking know. You can't take them out. Doesn't go high enough. Maybe I'm just not seeing something. Because I found the thing on the bottom. Is there another thing to this that I'm just not seeing? None of the above. What's this one? Where does this bring me? Exit. Wait, so can I go right below it? Just shoot up? This is bullshit. Like, what am I supposed to fucking do? I don't know, and it's making me very angry that I don't know right off the bat. Because I can't do anything about any of this. I can't move these. I can't. It's giving me very little options. And the thing is, it's probably a super simple task that I'm just not figuring out. And that's what's making me mad. Because that seems to be the case, especially right after I make the joke. Like, I'm trying to think of what I could do to make that even work. Like, I thought I could just bring this here and then drop it and then drop it. It would be enough. But apparently it's not heavy enough. Like, and you think recall would work. 
but it doesn't. And it's so fast, it doesn't give you time to really do anything other than go, well, I hope I make that. No way, it's not going to work. See? Not even that worked. I ain't doing this bullshit where I spend a million hours on one shrine and get embarrassed. I'm sorry, but we are looking up the Karakatag shrine, and we're going to watch some guy do it together. Kara. Kara. Atag shrine. Could take someone two minutes to do this, and it's taken me ten. So, just, just do it. Show me what I'm doing wrong. Show me why I'm being stupid. Okay. They're running. Yeah, they're getting, getting the treasure. I already figured that out. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't work. That's not how that goes. You goofy ass. Oh my god. No, I am the dumbass. It just takes a little bit of trickery. You'll see. We'll do this one first. Why not? Why not? Let's do this one first. Why not? No. So dumb. Didn't go high enough. Maybe I got it wrong. Hold on. I think that I thought that was it. I thought this guy had it. not doing it. What drugs is this guy on? How is he doing that? I have no idea how he did that.
Okay. That's one. This is... Quite possibly my least favorite in the game. Very much possible that it's my least favorite in the game. But that's fine. Actually, no. Because at least off the rails felt like it was kind of fun. Because like you're figuring certain things out. But that's my opinion. Geo thing, man. Alright, that's two. Oh my god, I would have lost my shit just now if that happened. Okay. That's two. Let's do three. Let's do three and end this shenanigans. <laughs> That is annoying. Come on. There it is. Let's go. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I probably never would have figured that out on my own. I probably would have gotten mad and just left. So I'm kind of glad I did what I did. I have to take some liberties in games, man. These are 100 hour long games. And you spend the entire time freaking out about everything. It sucks. Cheers. Plus it's a blind playthrough, so. If this was like my third time playing it and I didn't remember it, that'd be a problem. We've now done 66. 66 shrines. Six six shrines and eight of the things down below. That's kind of sad. Um, I guess to Elden. Right? I mean, it's the only thing I can think of now is to go to Elden. But we're going to be set on fire. So we need to be prepared to be set on fire. we got 18 minutes to hopefully not burn into flames. Now, last time I did this, I had, like, what? Six hearts? No, I had more than that. Actually, I had a decent amount in my Breath of the Wild playthrough. I did the exact same thing that I'm doing right now, like, where I bulked up a shit ton before I got to the main game. The only thing that does suck about this game, actually, I'm thinking about it now, there's no shrine thing. That kind of makes me upset. That was like a staple. How am I just now realizing that there was no sh shrine um, alarm thing? Sensor. Sensor makes more sense. Oh, that's weird. Oh, well. We're heading to Gerudo Town. So hopefully you guys are as excited about that as me. Because, honestly... In Breath of the Wild, that was probably my favorite part of the game. So, who knows? Swear to God, Octorok, you'll get your turn. Yeah, it's already starting to get hot. It's about to become downright impossible to survive. gotta go straight man it's gotta go balls deep into it balls deep and just suffer honestly I if I was you yeah 
just in case. Oh my god. Wish I could have grabbed that. That would have been cool. Can't you grab any of this? Bullshit. Bullshit this. So when I find a diamond, we're gonna like mine the fuck out of that, right? I'm just saying. Fuck was is going on? I hear that. What the fuck is this shit? Are these diamonds? No fucking way, bro. No clip. Come on. There's luminous stones. Come on. I knew that was gonna happen. Oh, you know what? I'll take it. Take, take the luminous stone and the flint. Fuck it. Got me like safe for nothing. That's fine. I see how it is. Look how far up we have. Oh, hold up. We got ourselves a shrine. What? What's going on with blue? What's the blue thing? Oh, that's actually where I'm heading right now. Hi, guys. I mean, guy. Fuck the other ones. Why is your area still swarming with bad guys? I thought we took care of that in Breath of the Wild. Why are there still so many bad guys that just roam free in these towns? I'm just saying. Suckers. This ain't nothing. Y'all ain't shit. Are you guys telling me you work alongside these assholes? I'm so disappointed. How are you even alive, lady? Or guy who's got a very good fashion sense. There is that. It might be a little feminine, but doesn't mean it's bad. Fuck it. Let's go. So I'm going to be getting rich as hell over the course of the next, I don't know, few hours. I just need to find diamonds, bro, and I'll make it so much easier. Sell them for, like, what, 250 a pop? Hey! Over here, it's important. We got to let you in on something. There are some untrustworthy fellas rolling around the city right now. So if you're loaded up on ore, you should probably sell it before you're scammed out of it. We're good, Gorons. We'll take it off your hands for a great price. How about three rupees for... No thanks. Hey, what are you doing? Uh-oh. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Fucking idiots. You almost got duped there, huh? No. Now that Death Mountain's eruptions have stopped and the lava's cooled, I've been seeing a lot more Hylian travelers. Which is great, except those two have been swindling travelers by offering to take their ore for next to nothing. After the marbled rock roast started surfacing, everyone's, everyone around here has been acting strange. So be mindful of any Gorons who've got marble rock roast. Thanks for the tip. My name is Ramala. I'm the jeweler from Gerudo Town, the southwest of Hyrule. Uh... The ore that Yunobo Co. Yunobo Co. Huh? Deals in is high quality, so I always come here to replenish my stock. If you're open to it, I'll gladly buy your ore off of you for my shop. Wow, rude! I never rip you off. Well, I guess you did just get ripped off, so your response is warranted. You did almost just get ripped off. 
I'm not going to force you. If you decide you like to sell it, let me know. Right now, I'm low on amber. If you sell a parcel of 10 pieces of amber, I'll buy them for a little more than you could sell them at other shops. All right, I'm off to Goron City to get more gems. Take care. Let's go to Goron City, baby. She's the amber dealer, baby. Oh, so now it's not as burning hot. And that's why people are more open to me, more open to being here. Goron City, baby. Been a while since we've been here. And we've got a shrine to do. Son of a bitch. This is crazy. But Yonobo Co, huh? My boy Yonobo's moved up in the world, apparently. Enjoying that ice spring. Look how cute they are. Everybody thinks that they're so ugly, but they're so adorable to me. Look at him. He's fuck you, you rip off piece of shit. This is amazing. This game is just outstanding. Last time we were here, Darunia and all that stuff. This is the Marakugak. Kukuk. Kugak. Shrine. There used to be a shrine there. I'm just pointing it out. We got a lot of stuff to do in this game still. It's ridiculous. <sighs> it's a little early to call an episode. I don't want to enter this shrine, though, until after I've done... I don't want to do a shrine until the next episode, so... How about we find a store, actually? I'm going to find a nice place to sell all my crap. There we go. Hello. Can I buy these? I'll take them all. How many do I have? 122. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, buddy. Buy my stuff. Buy my rubies for a lot, please. That's not bad. 200 for star fragment. Honestly, that's why I should... That's what I should do is star fragments. <laughs> if I'm being honest. I just want to see if I can do that. Because I only have one. This is just out of curiosity. I only have one. So you have to have multiple. That's slick. All right, guys. In the next episode of Let's Play The Legends of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom, we are going to do this shrine that's up here. And then, after we're done with the shrine, we will um, just continue. I guess we'll do start doing the Korons, the Korons story, the third of the shrines. There's also that bad bitch up there that we have to get. But that's, that's way way down the line. So thank you for watching. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda, The Tears of the Kingdom. See you guys then.